you can create a crystal report based on data stored in an XML file, on your local machine, or in an accessible network location. In this tutorial, you will connect to an XML file, to use as a data source in a report. Note that this tutorial was recorded using SAP Crystal Reports 2011, version 14.0.0.760. To navigate, use the viewer controls or follow the on-screen instructions, if available. This is a blank report with no data source. Use the database expert to connect to an XML file. Click Database Expert. Create a new connection to an XML file. Click plus to expand, create new connection. Click to scroll down. Click plus to open, XML and web services. For a data source, you can choose to use an XML file, an HTTP or HTTPS URL for an XML file or XML stream, or a web service. Browse to an XML file. Click to browse. Double click the customer XML file. If the XML file does not have embedded schema information, you must specify a schema definition file. The schema is used to determine how to represent the XML data in Crystal Reports. When you specify a schema, it is used instead of schema information that is embedded in, or referenced by, the XML file itself. You can also choose to have Crystal Reports validate the XML file against the schema definition file. Select the Validate XML checkbox. Click Next. Browse to the Schema Definition file. Click to browse. Double click the Customer XSD file. Click Finish. Crystal Reports interprets the XML schema as a data source with data tables and data fields. Add a table to the report. Click Plus to expand data route. Click to scroll right. Select the customer table. Click the right arrow. Click OK. Now, open the Field Explorer, to view the data source added to the report. Click Field Explorer. Drill into the data source, to view the data fields available for the report. Click Plus to expand database fields. Click Plus to expand the customer table. Click to scroll right. You have successfully connected to an XML file, to use as a data source in a report. This is the end of the tutorial.